What is up, everybody? For today's game, I'm going to be playing as Quinn in the top lane versus Fiora. Okay, so finally, you know, after the Pantheon game, I get to play Quinn top. And uh, yeah, I get to show off the Corsair Quinn skin that was actually on sale not too long ago. And it is actually her most recent skin. It doesn't have anything too flashy, it's just basically changes the way Quinn looks. And I think maybe the bird, I'm not sure. Uh, but this will be the first time that I'm playing with the skin so that's kind of exciting I guess um, anyway so since last game I did play two games after when I had that Jace game and I won both of them so right now my platinum won 37 LP I think I'm not sure if that's exactly what it was but it was something like that so I'm actually pretty high up in the plat one and uh, very close to breaking into diamond uh, like to me it's just a matter of question before I reach diamond like if I if I were to just play like 10 12 games a day after recording this I feel like I would reach diamond but as most of you can tell like I, I'm really taking my time here is doing as I like I'm not even sure when the season ends if someone knows when this actual season ends like just let me know in the comment section or like where an estimate would be because right now I'm a little bit clueless but I'm guessing like either October or or November even no I don't think I think November is a little bit too late uh, anyways anyways uh, we're in the game. Oh god, my sound is a little bit too loud. Let me turn it down a little bit. And, uh, I think it's Doran's Blade, right? Yeah, I think this is the start. Okay, so, uh, Quinn into Fiora. This is actually a pretty decent matchup for Quinn early on. I've, I've experienced this line quite a few times when Fiora was, like, considered super OP. But the problem here is that they have a Jarvan jungle, and Jarvan's like coming into meta again. It's like pretty annoying that he's even like a thing now. Um, yeah, Jarvan ganks top lane were pretty devastating, especially when you're a squishy because you know it's just so much burst. It's very hard to actually live it unless you can like you know uh, flash out of the way, out of the way in time, and you can't always guarantee that, unfortunately. Anyways, Quinn, Quinn, Quinn. So it's been a while since I played Quinn top. How long was it actually? Hmm. Uh, the recording of Quinn was like hundred number hundred eighty seven or something like that. It was quite a while ago. Um, sh I think she's still pretty decent. Uh, I know that the meta changed a little bit in like um, patch six point seventeen, but the fact that Riven got stronger doesn't really change that much because Quinn was already having like a pretty decent matchup against Riven. So I don't actually think uh, Quinn has fallen that much in the meta. So we'll see. We'll see. Maybe the fact that some champions in the jungle have become better makes it a little bit worse place for Quinn to be top. Uh, but I'm not quite sure. I really have not played enough to actually be able to tell this. But I'm hoping that Quinn is still a decent pick in top lane. We'll find out after this game, I guess. Or at least get a, a small taste of it. Cause I'm gonna start E because she is the kind of champion that does jump in. Like when you try to like do damage to her, she ends up like going all in almost. So by by being able to like kind of knock her back the moment she goes ham on you, like it's a it's a, a little bit of a not comeback mechanic, but oh damage already half health on the Fiora, totally worth it. Like being being able to knock back the Fiora for a little bit at least, it, it's actually pretty decent. So let's go ahead and last hit that. Kind of want to auto attack the Fiora here. Okay, Fiora's using her Q to last it. Interesting. She's going to be very careful, I guess. How does the Q work again on Fiora? Does it refund mana if you last it with it? I don't think it does. It's not like uh, uh, Irelia Q or anything. Got my Q spell now, so I got that Exploding Bird. Finally. This minion. Um, it's kind of annoying that the enemy team also has like a, a Cinder on the team. Whoa. Okay, hang on. No, really? There's a bird. I mean, there's a minion blocking my bird. Oh my god, that could have been so much damage. Like, I'm I'm getting to the point where like I could potentially kill Irelia or Fiora, not Irelia. Jesus, got Irelia on the mind. Okay. Anyways, I'm not sure where Jarvan is. I would love to not randomly die to like a a gank right now. Let's just hit Q here. Oh my god, I thought she would actually walk into that, but not exactly the minion I expected was taking damage there. I gotta be careful, I'm gonna get ganked here. So many times I've been ganked because I decided to push in early, allow like, like three minutes. Oh, Jarvan is uh, around middle. I oh, saw him. Okay. Okay. So being pushed in like this to Fiora is not actually that bad because I'm not losing too many minions right now. Okay, let's just hit that. Oh, wow. Not enough 80. Okay, here we go. Uh huh. Okay. So she avoided my passive damage, but she still ate my turn of lords, so it's okay. Okay. 
So far, so good. I'm just hoping. I'm just hoping that Jarvis doesn't take like the long way around and goes like through the river. If he goes through the river, I'm fucked. I'm assuming that he's around red buff right now. Okay. Got my level two Q. I'm not sure if I should be maxing out E in this lane. Cause having your 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 uh, what's it called? Having your E up more often against Fiora is actually pretty strong. But most of the time, you will be maxing out your Q first. Like against someone like Riven or Renekton, you would definitely be maxing out your E first. Oh, there's Jarvan. Oh, he's kind of low health though. Okay, well, put my ward down. If Jarvan shows up, I think I'm just gonna go aggro on him. Because he's low health, I could just ignite him and kill him. I think I should have done that actually. Should you just let him come to me and then when he got. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Hang on. Let's just. Oh no! This is not how I wanted to go! Oh no! Oh, that was so bad though! Oh my god, yay for no F. At least Vladimir somehow got first blood in middle. I'm not sure how he did it, but apparently he did. And like, Cinder has exhaust, so that makes no sense. At least I managed to stay alive just enough for like, uh, for them to get first blood top one. That was actually really bad by me. I don't know what I was thinking. I was expecting more bursts for some reason. Nice. It looks like team is actually doing pretty decent though. Good job, team. Good job. Okay. Anyway, so uh, was it Jarvan or was it Fiora that flashed? I think it was Jarvan. I'm not 100% sure. Anyways, yeah, that was a little bit crazy by me. I guess I thought I did more damage than I than I actually was doing. I don't know. When I play Quinn, usually I'm super fed, so I always have like high damage expectations from my spells. But uh, yeah, Jarvan didn't take any damage at all there, so I was like, "What? Okay, he's not dead. I'm fucked." <laughs> maybe using my flash there was a mistake, or maybe he's trying to like. Yeah, okay, okay. So let me, let me rephrase that. The actual mistake was when I decided to take a fight with Jarvan. Like that's hundred percent. I don't know what I was thinking. I thought I could take him out and just kind of like escape Fiora, but I could not burst. Yarvin in time, like I was just dead. Sad. Oh well, it happens. You get ganked and then you get wrecked. And if you're stupid like me, you'll actually try to fight it and end up wasting your flash. Damn it. Alright, whatever. Mm. A little bit regretful there, but I still think I should be able to do fine against Yura. It's just she's got a kill on me, so that means she's got a little bit more gold than I did when going back. Hopefully, it won't be too bad though. What did she get? Oh, Phage. Okay, Phage is not too bad actually. Oh, what? How did my auto tag not go off there? Are you kidding me right now? Jesus Christ, this game, man. Sometimes. Uh, should I just use my ultimate to start roaming now? I have this feeling that Jarvan's just gonna be around. So, you know what? Because Cinder is like, oh, there's Jarvan. Okay. You know what? Because I know Jarvan is around middle, I can actually play with Fiora while she's under a turret. That was good. Auto attack her in the face, why not? Oh my god, please. Where's the last hits? Uh huh. Got some auto attacks on her. Oh, that was so good. No, my exploding bird didn't hit her. All right, let's just get the minions over here so that. It... Oh, dude, Balin. Balin, Balin. At least I'm in front of Fiora, so if she wants to teleport to Balin, like I'm, I'm ready to. Oh God, intercept it. Oh God, no. Oh no, I'm so dead though. Oh, that was pretty bad. Yeah, that was a pretty obvious, like, Fiora W there. I shouldn't have done that. Fuck, she was totally gonna do that every time. God damn it. Okay, I'm playing really badly now. This is so bad. Okay. That was not even, like, the phage doing work for her. Like, that's just Fiora being Fiora. Like, she's level 6, and then if she gets a stun on you, like, yeah, you're pretty rip. Anyways, uh, let's go to top lane, I guess. Warwick is a 6 now, so he should be able to pull off a gank for me at some point. It's actually pretty sad. Damn it. Mm. Alright, well, bird mode. So the bird is kind of slightly different. He has like a little bit of like yellowish or tan colored uh, wings. Or was that always like that for Valor? I'm not sure. <laughs> I'm not exactly very... I don't exactly remember the bird's wings too well. Okay, so Fiora's around middle now. Not sure what's up with that. Is she taking out the pink ward or what is she doing? Okay, she took out the ward somehow. Anyway, so uh, I guess I'm gonna be relegated to his farming. Like at this point, like Fiora can actually do as she likes almost, and I should probably focus on like ganking more than actually laning. As sad as it sounds, at this point, 
Fira is tough enough to use like resist me and kind of like just get ganks from Jarvan all day. Um, is there anybody here? Is there a pink ward here? No, there is not. Okay, let's go to Balin maybe. Oh no, that's Syndra. Damn it. Okay, Balin is not even Balin yet, so it was a little quick tour. Okay, so Warrior is gonna back me up now. Ignite ready. Okay, that's gonna motivate Warwick even more to do something. Okay. Oops. Okay, hang on. Where is she? Oh, please. Warwick, where were you? you betrayed my trust. Oh, please. Oh, yes. Oh my god, that was so close. Where did Warwick go? Like, seriously. Did he like take like the biggest U-turn or whatever? Like he swear to God, he was nowhere. I was so scared, man. He needed to be there ASAP, and he just did it like the worst like detour ever, man. I don't know, man. That was scary. All right, whatever. Uh, what matters is we actually accomplished it. So, yeah. Okay, let's try and gank bot then. Okay, so I did. I did top lane. Oh wait, maybe mid. Okay, let's swap arena a little bit. Swap arena here. I'm coming, I'm coming. Oh, well, he doesn't have a... Oh, wow, look at this Vladimir being cocky as hell, though. Okay, let's go balling, maybe? At this point, I just want to be somewhere else in top lane so that, you know, if Fiora comes around... Um, can you push? Can you push? Oh, come on! Stop him! Oh! Oh, please! I'm gonna flash out before, like, that freaking teleport destroys us. That was really greedy by Triss, though. Okay, okay, they're fine, they're fine. We got the kill, that's all that matters. Oh my god, are you kidding me right now? Or? Oh, dude! No, wait, Tristana, you're going crazy! What are you doing, Tristana? Oh, wait, maybe, maybe, maybe! Maybe, what the hell? Look at this! There we go, killing spree. Aw, oh, rip in peace. Nice, okay. So roaming totally paid off. Screw laning, dude. Got the teleport from Fiora and she got destroyed. Is this worth helping? Because I'm kind of low and want to go back to top lane. I also want to get this thing too. Yeah, I noticed one of my biggest flaws when I'm playing solo queue is that sometimes I trust my teammates a little bit too much and I never spend my gold. I'm sure you've seen it in one, some of my recent videos. I used to like, when I see a ping from my teammates, I'm like, oh, I gotta help them. But sometimes, you know, that kind of mentality will fuck you over. Cause look, now, now a fight's gonna happen. At least he got the dragon, he didn't really need my help, but I would have been delayed and I would have missed minions at top. So yeah, slowly learning from my mistakes. Pretty slowly though, but at least I'm learning. <laughs> okay, I got my Joma's Ghost Blade, that's gonna definitely be helpful to actually get a, you know, attempt at killing Fiora. Nice, what the hell is this? Why are we getting kills too? It's that ultimate, man. It sets things up so easily. That Tom Kench seemed really squishy though. Oh, see your shoes. Uh oh. Uh oh, Spaghettios. Wait, wait. If he ults me, like it's okay. Okay, because then I can do this. Yes. Get gangstered. Look at that shit. I just waited for him to ultimate so I can e off of him. If I did it any earlier, I would have tra been trapped in his ult. So being patient there was super key. Okay, you know what? Because Jarvan just went back and probably assumed that I went back to base. I'm gonna be here to meet the minion waves. Pop my pots too, so I can just uh. Boom! That hit her. Nice. Though she's kind of life stealing back up pretty quickly. I'm scared of the Jarvan. Where is he? Oh, he's not top lane. Okay. So I do have my Jumbo's Ghost Blade. My Ignite is going to be up in 5 seconds. Boom! What? How did my Exploding Bird not hit Fiora there? I'm, I'm kind of scared actually. I think Jarvan is in these brushes. Like, Fiora's kind of playing a little bit too forward, I think, for being that health. Mm, my my W isn't up yet. Yep, there's Jarvan. He's around top side, so that's for sure. Screw this. I'm gonna go next to Warwick, so at least I have like a fighting chance if Jarvan jumps my face. Please, Warwick. Or maybe not. Okay, whatever. Oh, there's Jarvan. Okay, he's fine. We're fine, we're fine, we're fine. But uh, Fiora's managed to like heal up a lot. And now Fiora's kind of running away. It's just kind of uncharacteristic. Did she, did she think that uh, like Warwick's around here? Maybe like she thinks I'm doing mind games. Oh! Oh no! Oh no! No! What the hell is that burst? Oh my god, it didn't even. It doesn't even look that much. 
Wow. Okay, I'm just being bad here. I, this is one of those games when I actually have to be carried. Because right now, I'm just playing like a clown. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, so what do I need? If I'm going to survive Fiora, I think I need Boost of Swiftness. No, actually, that might be completely troll. Mm, let's just stick to this. Yeah, this, this seems smarter to me. More attack speed, more damage. Oh, I should probably have ulted in freaking in the fountain so I didn't lose too much mana. Bad. My bad, my bad. Oh no, I lost my turret. She's so low too, I can't believe she killed me with my ignite on her. It seems like my ignite does nothing to her. Damn it. Alright, anyways, let's just go back to farming and try to get like a... Either Phantom Dancer or Static Ship. I might go for a Static Ship just because crazy. Um, yeah, so we're gonna do the old school uh, Quinn build. Because apparently that's been winning in solo queue again, so, yep. Static ship into Infinity Edge. Kind of like an AD carry almost, except you start with Jomos. Jomos Rush kind of always made sense though, it's just like that armor pen and just CDR. And of course the active, which is like really helpful when ganking and stuff. Maybe you can gank balling. Maybe we can pull this off once more. There's a pink quarter here, so they can't see me when as I pass through. Uh, if there's no... No ward here, that would be nice, but there's a huge siege minion in the way. Alright. Okay. She got rid of a ward there. Okay, there's a minion there, so I can't cross the brush yet. If Jarman comes bottling, we can just Shrek them. We could probably use tower diving win. But the thing is, we have to focus the Tom Kinch, otherwise Tom Kinch is just gonna eat Lucian and he'll be fine. Okay, here we go. Oh. Oh wow, they healed though. Okay. Oh, really? Okay, nice. We got the we got the Tom Kenish at least. Look no sums. Gotta type that out. It's a pretty big deal. Anyways, yeah, Fiora's kind of winning the lane against me, so it's not much I can do except like try to help my teams win their lanes harder. Oh wow. Maybe should have helped them take the tower out, but I feel like I need to stay here so that they don't take the tower completely. Uh, let's just go, Sargris. I'm coming, Vladimir! Hang in there! Come on, come on, come on! Oh, they're not here anymore. Damn it. Alright. Was that worth it? Tower for, like, a kill on, uh... Who was it that got the kill? Was it Warwick or Trisana? I'm not sure. But at least I feel more like a team player. I feel like I'm actually doing something while actually, you know... Not really able to do much in my own lane because I feel like the the fear is outclassing me heavily right now, and the worst part is that I don't actually think Quinn is supposed to lose this lane this hard. I think I'm actually is playing really badly, and uh, yeah, also the the death at the beginning totally could have been avoided. It was just me being super cocky for some reason. Oh wow, one v one or one v two maybe. Okay, let's just do this thing. Warwick should probably get this thing. Or should I get it? Because I mean, I would be able to push. I don't think Warwick is going to push much. Okay, I'm getting it. May as well help Warwick do that then. Oh, wait! They're getting someone. Come on, come on, come on! Oh, okay. I guess Syndra flashed. What'd she do? Oh, Dragon is up. What is that? That's Wind Dragon. Oh, he's so tanky. I was about to consider like going in on him, but he would have like destroyed me. Go back! Karma, you're just way too close to the wall. If Jarvin goes in, like, she's screwed. Okay. Hold mid, Quinn. I wonder for how long I can do that when there's, like, four people. Okay, anyways. But yeah, it's pretty important to do that when you're, like, actually losing your lane pretty hard. If you can guarantee your lanes to win even harder, like, that's probably the best way to spend your time. Because if you're just going to stay in middle and keep, like, dying to wh whatever laner you've been dying to, like, you're not really making, you know, things better. It's so, like, going for legit attempts at ganking is, like, the best solution. Wait, what's going on top lane? Is Warwick 1v1ing the Fiora and winning? Holy crap, Warwick is a ridiculous champion. Always has been. Oh, wow. Well. Freaking tank Kenji, dude. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Warwick is fighting Jarvan, he's trying to run away from him with his freaking ult. I'm coming dude, I got ignite and everything. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on. Come on, come on. 
Ah, oh, he's not gonna fall for it. So they're just pushing mid while like we're just chilling here. Ouch. Okay, not too bad. Is this wise? How tanky is he? Oh, he's super tanky though. Hmm. Maybe should have been with my team instead of like dealing with Jarvan here. I don't have any mana, so it's better to just go back now. Yeah, I can't do much here. Tom Kinch would just eat somebody up. There's Jarvan. I'm gonna be back to base. Let's buy. What should I buy? Should I just buy this? Yeah, let's just do it. Let's go crazy. Damn, my time in top lane was actually kind of wasted. Shouldn't have done that. I'm coming. I'm here. Warwick, Warwick, get ready, dude. You just hold him. Wow. Wait, what? Okay. I see. Oh my god. Oh, he got him. And Jarvin even wasted his jump. Oh, we're gonna fight them one by one. <laughs> she fucked up her Q. <laughs> I would have been fucked if she actually did that properly, though. Okay, nice. Warwick took out two people, I took out one. There we go. That's the teamwork we were looking for. Kind of sad that Karma had to die there. We probably could have been. It could, probably could have saved her if I realized that she was actually getting shreked by Tom Kench. Okay, nice. I was hoping that Tristana would get that. It looked like she wasn't even paying attention. Let's get rid of that blue trinket as soon as possible. Okay, let's put W here. Okay, there's only a, a lonely raptor there. Mm, are we gonna do this, Warwick? Can we even, like, 2v1 it? Oh, we're doing it. Holy shit, we're doing it. This feels so not safe at all. But Balin at least is, is keeping like the rest of the map like distracted. So this is like not even on the minds of the enemy team right now. Oh shit, I'm taking some, like some heavy duty damage here. I'm just helping the war get this done in time. Ooh, oh my god, are you kidding me? Oh my god, I just gave it away too. Please, okay, okay, okay. I, I thought maybe I could kind of like out go around the outskirts of this thing. Okay, he did it. Nice. Alright. I don't know what I was thinking. Something's wrong with me today. I'm playing like really troll as fuck. I knew that they like, I was probably gonna die if I just stood around there. But I thought like, you know, maybe a little bit more damage I can help him with. Because like, the Baron was going down really slowly. Oh, at least we got it, man. I mean, if we didn't get that, because like, with me dying, I think that gets announced to the enemy team, right? When you die from like, uh, the, what's it called, the elite monsters. Oh man, that could have gone really badly, but fortunately enough, most of the new team were actually around bot lane, so like my death didn't actually change much. <sighs> Except my, my KDA though. <laughs> KDA is rip. Four kills, I mean four deaths, that's like almost unsalvageable. Unless I'm going like on a crazy killing streak right now. Oh, look at that, it's Lucian. Oh, there's a lot of people there. Oh man, hang on, hang on, hang on. Maybe we can get the Lucian. Oh, okay, fuck Lucian. Okay, hang on. Oh, I got the Tom Kench instead. TK no exhaust. Nice one. Alright, is this worth W for? Oh, the overkill though. No, the bird didn't get him, please. Whoa, what the hell? How did Jarvan get there? Oh my god, look at Vladimir though. Damn, I wish I could help him, but there's a freaking tower in the way. Let's just go to middle. Come on, there's a Baron buff on us, we can do this. Come on! A little bit unfortunate that, you know, Vlad even died there, but... Whatever, we're gonna get towers. Don't worry, we're gonna try and make up for it. Dude, I'm playing so troll. I'm so sad. <laughs> I feel like there's at least three deaths I could've totally avoided. If I played smart. Oh, shit! Wait, wait, wait for me! Oh, okay, he didn't even need me. Uh, okay, hang on. Oh, please! Warwick, no! You betrayed me! Whoa, the sidestep of justice! Warwick, no! Switch targets, no! No, Warwick, I hate you! 
Oh, the sidestep! Oh, wow, the damage of Fioris is too much. Too much. I need to get my Infinity Edge if I even want to get close to killing her. Um, we're getting there, though. Get the Beetle Sword. That was pretty uh, useless to actually die like that in top lane. Should have just backed out, really. I mean, we got the Tam Kench, Tom Kench, and we got the Cinder as well, so that's worth it, right? Two for two. Yeah. Oh god, what is this? <laughs> Jarvan actually chooses to run away from, from uh, Karma, a little bit strange there. But now, he sure wish he kept it up. Oh, rip. Alright, let's go. Oh wait, oh, I forget to use my ultimate in Fountain again. Okay, whatever, I didn't lose mana. I regained it, like, immediately. Let's push top lane again. There's a minion wave there. Whoa. <laughs> Vladimir has no shield. He's just going crazy with Hextech Proto-Blade. Proto-Belt, not Blade, sorry. Alright, here we go. No! Okay, got it. Mm, they're pushing middle. Are they gonna be fine without me? Oh, no, rip, lad. They get the inhibit, at least. I'm just trying to create pressure from top side since I'm so f I'm too far away to hop out anyway. Oh wait, maybe I'm not. I think he's ult out. Ult in, I mean. Oh, the Lucian though. Oh wait, I'm gonna cast him out. Screw you! <laughs> Look at that, he jumps right into my kick. <laughs> oh, awesome. Let's just go to bot side. Alright, my, my KDA is still ripped though. Like, when you get a 4 or 5 diff, like, uh, score, like, your, your KDA is ripped. You'd rather keep it like 2 or 1. 3 at best. Nice, nah, stole myself a turret too, why not? Another point of W. Wow, freaking Warwick has a GA. Maybe that's what I should have been work working on after like getting the static show. Oh my god, that crit though. Wait, what the hell am I getting aggro? Come on. Why, why did I actually get aggro there? Do I have like red buff on me or something? Uh oh. I'm gonna flash out because I don't know if I'm gonna get jumped on or something. I'd rather, you know, save my life here because uh, we did get the tower. I don't think we can get much more than that. Wait, what was this grief? Oh no, we're gonna get away in time. No, I'm not. No, screw you. Ghost blade away. Wait, what is going on here though? Like, are they still fighting? Oh no, Vladimir kind of killed himself there for no reason. I'm not full health. Okay, what's this? Wow, I actually got a lot of money. When did this happen? Okay, well. They're gonna get the Ocean Dragon, which is not a big deal, actually. I'm kinda happy that's what we're about to miss out on. Warwick is like, fuck this. I'm gonna kill Lucian one last time. No, he's not gonna get it. I'm with you, Warwick. Come on, come on. Your backup is right here. Let's go this way. Come on, come on. Follow me, follow me, Warwick. I'm the scout. Oh, red buff, though. Look at that. Probably would have missed it just because of the fact that, you know, it feels like the enemy team is going to show up at any point. Let's put a blue trinket here. Oh, <gasps> dude, 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 dude. Oh, shit, wait. Oh, no. Oh, no. Ah, nah. I'm going to ignite her. Here we go. Oh, my God. That burst, though. Jesus. Okay. Wait, wait. Team is fighting. Oh, okay. They actually got into a winning fight. Maybe we can cut off the Lucian, though. Come on. Go for the Syndra, of course, because she's the one that's... Okay. I was. I decided to be nice here. I decided to be nice here just because, you know, Tristana was uh, doing well. Okay, let's just keep going. And that's the game. Wow. I don't know if I, I should say that I got completely carried here, but I definitely lost my lane really hard on my own. So I, I kind of feel shameful about this game. I am glad how it turned out, though. Jesus Christ. I deserve some of this, though, after some of the games that I've, I experienced recently. <laughs> Not a way to put it. Oh, man. I need to work on my points. I don't think I should lose to Fiora like that. No. Yeah, yeah, the, the the E on her when, like, she could use W whenever she felt like it was, like, really bad. Like, she anticipated it so well. It was, like, so obvious that I would go for it. That's when you should, like, hold on to it. Oh, nice. A key fragment. Sweet. 
Okay, nice. Excellent karma, excellent Warwick. The MVPs, of course. Uh, my farm was atrocious. <laughs> Warwick actually nearly caught up to me. I did have at least three more farm than Fiora. Small victory there. Uh, 16, 17k damage almost. Uh, just over Warwick. Nice. And Vladimir. Okay, so I wasn't actually doing that bad. I did do some crazy damage towards the end. But as you can see, Tristana obviously was the MVP in damage. Uh, let's look at damage dealt to champions and damage taken. Whoa. Warwick actually took quite a beating. I didn't even realize that. Hmm. At least it's all more than I took. And definitely Tristana did that. And Jarvis is just okay. Wow. <laughs> I'm always fascinated by looking at like damage done and damage taken. I notice on losing teams you will always see like high like purple bars, even on AD carries, which kind of tells you the story, right? Like the AD carry simply was you know toyed around with on the enemy team. Okay, plus 20 OP, 57 OP total in platinum one. Halfway to the promos, I'm getting there. Alright, anyways, hope you guys still managed to enjoy this video, and if you did like it, it would be nice to give it a like, if this is the first time you're watching one of the videos, you can always subscribe to me, because I'm always trying to upload a new rank game daily, and uh, of course, if you have any kind of criti critique or feedback, feel free to say so in the comment section, or if you just want to say hello, I don't know, people do that sometimes, then feel free to do so, as I do read the comment sections quite often. Um, yeah, okay, thank you guys for watching, this has been me, Steve Rockstars, and hopefully, I'll see you guys for next time.